Going to the reactions on the previous story, there is some more breaking news coming in on this particular story itself. Further cracks being seen in the INDIA alliance. Congress is firm on a no alliance with TMC in West Bengal. Now, we, uh, News 18 spoke to the spokesperson of West Bengal Congress leader Kostha Bhakti, who has now come out and said that we will not accept any adjustment with TMC in Bengal because their hand have our workers' blood. Why will we adjust? So this is the particular breaking piece of information that we are getting. It is quite crucial because remember there is a meeting slated to happen in Mumbai on 31st of August and right now there seems to be a lot that is happening within the INDIA alliance itself. And we have Kamalika joining us back on the broadcast. Kamalika, this is the statement that has come in from the Congress spokesperson in Bengal, uh, Kostav Bagchi, and he has said that we will not be joining hands with the TMC foreign alliance. How are we looking at this statement, especially at a crucial juncture like this? See, he has uh, given the statement in a local level. And also, he has uh, posted in social media that they are not guinea pigs and they consider TMC to be pigs and they consider TMC to be the mother of the democracy. Now, this is the local Bengal Congress, local leaders are saying. We need to see that what Adhi Chaudhary or what the Congress High Command is saying because this is not the first time that Congress High Command has not listened to Bengal Congress and has go and has gone ahead with an alliance with TMC. Now there where the point is and they are saying that they are going to revolt if such things happen. See so this looks about polls for Congress in Bengal it's a do or die situation. Because in assembly they don't have any representation. In Panchayat the fight in Mushidabad the fight was seen between Adhik Chaudhary and Trinamool Congress everywhere. But there, we, see, we saw that during Parliament, the, the equation between Adi Chaudhary and TMC was good. Now, this has really created this revolt inside uh, the Congress. That's what we are getting. Because there are, in, in, in the political circles, this thing... Right, Kamalika, please do stay with us. But we have Kostav Bagchi, Congress spokesperson, whose statement we were just speaking of, joining us on the broadcast. Mr. Bagchi, a very good morning to you. Well, very firstly, do give us your comments on this Congress TMC alliance that you've spoken about. No, no possibility is absolutely in West Bengal. The uh, Congress is very clear on its stand. Congress has been... Uh, fighting against the Trinamool Congress, their atrocities, their oppression, uh, their tyrannical rule since a long period of time. We have had past experiences going with the Trinamool Congress and their only agenda had been to decimate the Congress party in the state of West Bengal, to kill the Congress workers in the state of West Bengal, to devastate the party in the state of West Bengal. So the uh, fundamental thing is that with regard to uh, an alliance with TMC, the grassroots level workers, the grassroots level supporters of the Indian National Congress have clearly said a no. We have already informed it to the leadership also that we are very clear on our stand. So the PCC president also has been vocal on this thing after we had said so. Uh, PCC president had also said the same thing that we are not going to get into any sort of alliance with the Trinamool Congress in the state of West Bengal. So, there might be some kind of like, uh, you see, uh, uh, there has been an overall, uh, uh, there has been an uh, attempt to build a perception, to build a narrative that uh, with regard to uh, uh, alliance in the state of West Bengal, there will be Trinamool and Congress going together hand in hand. But there is no chance. In West Bengal, we are going to fight against the TMC, we will defeat the TMC, we are going to uh, absolutely fight without any second thought against the Trinamool Congress. Right, Mr. Bagchi. But also, when we speak of the grassroots level, we definitely understand the equation in the state level. But also, if we are to bring in the central level alliance that we are talking about here, the INDIA alliance, such strong statements coming in at the state level, don't you think that will also affect the INDIA alliance that we have? See, uh, we are party workers in the state of West Bengal. It's for the national leadership to determine what is going to happen, what is not going to happen. But for us, we can say it blatantly that for us, for Congress workers in the state of West Bengal, we don't mind anything, but no alliance with the Trinamool Congress at any given cost. Right, Mr. Bagchi. Also, so is there any kind of negotiation that we can look at when it comes to the uh, TMC and Congress joining hands at the national level, if needed at the grassroots level as well? No, that's something which is, which is a very far-sighted thing and 
uh, there is there's no certainty about it because in the vice presidential elections we have also seen mamta banerjee trying to uh, be uh, trying to be there in the opposition unit and last minute she had backed out so her credibility is under a terrible question so uh, ultimately what she does ultimately whether she is a uh, 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 you see uh, uh, this thing trojan horse of the bjp whether she had been planted by the bjp we do not know anything what will be her stand in future day that is something which mamta banerjee cannot just assure and say her party workers also so it's something like it's, it's futuristic the present thing that is for determination before us is whether there is going to be an alliance or seat adjustment uh, with the trinamool congress in the state of west bengal for which we say a big no right mr bagchi thank you for joining us on the